how can one human being be this extra in like such a short amount of time? I mean, just really. Hey y'all, what's up and welcome back to my channel. We're being very extra today, can you tell? So usually in my wedding series videos, I like to wear my bride shirts, but they're all like tank tops and like very thin and it's freaking freezing today because Irma's coming or she may not come in. I don't know what's happening with Irma right now, but I'm cold. So I was like, you know what? We're gonna get out our little, from the bridal fair that I got, my little brad sash, my little yellow brad sash, my fake little veil. And we're gonna wear it today, cause oh, why not, right? Why, why be normal when you can be just so over the top and extra? But what we're here to talk about, I'm gonna show you guys my save the dates. So hopefully, because I'm hoping the hurricane doesn't put mail off and everybody gets their invitations on time. Crossing all my little fingers and toes. Everybody gets their, their invitations by the time this video goes out. Cause if not, oh freaking well. I decided to make this video because, and I know, I know, People say I'm crazy for sharing this much information with you guys about my wedding. But let's just, let's be really real for like two seconds. Let's get on a deeper level here. I am not insecure. I totally get that everybody has weddings all the time. I'm not the only bride. I will never be the only bride. There have been billions of weddings before mine. There will be billions of weddings after mine. And the reason that I make so many wedding series videos and reveal so much to you guys on YouTube and my blog is because if I have something that can help somebody else or if I have something that somebody else might like, I want to show that to you guys and help you guys. And I love Pinterest. I know we all get our ideas from Pinterest. And so a lot of this stuff is going on Pinterest after the wedding, but a lot of it goes up on Pinterest now. I share my wedding stuff and my wedding details and all of my ideas with you guys because I know I'm not alone in this. There are tons of brides who are getting married on the same day that I am, although I don't directly know anybody. Please leave me in comments below if you are getting married on May 26, 2018, because shout out to you, it's the best wedding day ever. But I just wanted to share my save the date with you guys. I'm super, super excited. So before we get into the video and before I forget because I'm rambling, make sure to go below and subscribe if you are not already because I put up three videos every single week and I want you to be a part of my YouTube family if you are not already. So let's just get into it. So I do have my save the day in this beautiful little white envelope, but the actual save the dates went out in a gold envelope. So this is the beautiful envelope that all of them were in. And I absolutely love this envelope. It is the most gorgeous thing. Now I know people are like, oh my God, why on earth would you do a gold envelope? It's just gonna end up in somebody's trash. I used to be one of those people that thought that. And then when I got the gold envelopes, it makes a statement. It says exactly what I want to say about my wedding. I'm having a formal wedding. I'm having a pretty wedding. It's my color scheme is white and gold and rose gold because my ring is rose gold. So, hey, gold envelopes, why freaking not, right? So I'm just gonna stop rambling. Mm. Dun 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 dun. This is it. It's such a non monumental moment for you guys, right? I mean, it truly is. But this is my save the date. Not sure if you guys can really tell. I will insert some close-ups if I can. Um, this is a save the date. It does have pearlized paper. This is what we purchased from Wedding Paper Divas. Now, very sad news. Wedding Paper Divas has announced that they are closing their doors after 11 years, I believe, of business. And so, unfortunately, you will not be able to get these specific save the dates anymore, but I will share you some identical ones or very, very close ones that I can find with you guys in the description bar below. Now, I know that they are not, Wedding Paper Divas is joining with Shutterfly, so maybe you can find the exact thing, but what I love about this is this is our engagement photo. This is a photo that we have used for a lot of things when it comes to our wedding. And I actually let my fiance pick the picture. There were some pictures that I liked more, but he really liked this one. So this is the photo that we used. I like that it's got structure to it. I love that the save the date is gold and in really fancy writing. And then it just says 
Mariah and Samuel, May 26th, 2018, Spartanburg, South Carolina. On the back, there are three gorgeous photos that we used for our Save the Dates. Now, I had three outfits that I wore for engagement photos, and this is actually the same outfit that you're seeing there. You just can't tell because it's super close, but I wore this purple dress, I wore a blue dress, and then the white dress. I did talk about them in my engagement photos video that I will link below. I showed that last week and I love that video. Um, I talk about why I chose to wear long dresses and why we chose to have more formal engagement photos just to kind of sum it up because we're having a formal wedding and I think that this save the date really depicts that. I love it so, so much and I'm probably going to put it on Pinterest very, very soon because I love save the dates. I love looking at them. I love seeing ideas. I had so many ideas. I found so many that were structured like this, um, some that were vertical just a ton of different ideas and this is what I came up with. So if you guys want something similar, you are more than welcome to. Wedding Paper Divas is not exclusive to me and my fiance. So um, Minted is not exclusive to me and my fiance. So if you guys love this design and you want to use it, I will link as many similar ones as I can find below because it is in fact gorgeous. And like I said, it is pearlized paper and then we have gold envelopes that were absolutely stunning with it. This is a very high quality paper. Um, but it's not that like thick cardstock and that's what we really, really loved. In picking your save the dates, I think that something you should really focus on is finding one that makes you look happy. Now we have a ton of photos where we look more serious, more straight faced, and then there's some that we are laughing. Now we did pick um, this photo and this photo, which are a little bit more straight faced for the back of our save the dates. You do get that option with Wedding Paper Divas to put your pictures on the back for no additional charge. And so obviously we decided to do that. But when it comes to your actual save the date photo, pick one that makes you happy because I absolutely love that like we look just so happy and so in love in this photo and it's not anything like too serious and so you kind of get just like oh we're just so happy to get married you guys should have seen me yesterday in the car after we put him in the mailbox ah, get to get married to Sam I'm so excited he's so cute I need to calm down I feel like I'm always forever being so extra when it comes to talking about marrying him because I'm so flippin excited to be his wife I'm so excited to have him as my husband <laughs> Okay, calm down. Y'all don't care about that. Enough is enough. But that's pretty much it. I wanted to share my save the dates with you guys just because I'm stupid excited and I'm about to put them up on Pinterest and you guys are my YouTube family so I wanted you to see them first. So that is pretty much it for this very short video. As always, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for watching. Tell me below if there are any more wedding series you want to see. I'm so excited. We're about eight and a half months away. But I love you guys. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time.